<clears throat> so we might be too late for the sunrise. Um, the sun is completely up and I don't see it coming up anywhere. So we might have missed it. Um, but you know what? It's okay. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful morning. Um, and I'm so grateful. Um, I'm going to show you guys. Look at this view. Look how stunning this view is. I'm about to walk down to the beach. Um, and just give gratitude to God and, uh, for my life and where it's at right now. I still have lipstick on from last night. Yikes, guys. And I showered and everything. This is what I'm saying. Your girl really was trying to make this. Uh, she wanted to make it. So did whatever I needed to do. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to go down and give thanks. And I'll be back. I'm going to walk down this rocky pathway so Isla just has so many different areas where you can go to the beach um, it's a little bit more rocky over here um, which I'm okay with different thing and I really didn't really process that or understand that probably until I reached my 30s and like what it meant to understand a form of self-care of doing things when you wanted to do them or doing them if you felt like it you know what I'm saying like your free time doesn't necessarily mean that it's your free time to hang out with people your free time can mean like you have free time to spend time with yourself and these are the type of things that I've learned over the two years. Like, I really learned and understood what it means to have like self-care, to have a balance in your life in regards to taking care of yourself. And once you choose yourself first, once you choose yourself first, everything falls into play. I just want to say to you guys, as I stand here on the island, uh, so, I just want to make sure that you guys are taking in this experience of what I'm having in this beautiful island. And yeah. Alright guys, so we just left that location and drove a little further down um, the road. There's a lot of beautiful beach are buying um, and I just saw it on this side of town this island it's interesting it's a small town but it's actually like has so many sides and so many parts of it um, so he took me over to the this little cliff thing that kind of looks over the ocean um, it's very beautiful I'm going to show you guys storage up full again i'm biting my storage on my camera but we're getting ready to have breakfast we came to this beautiful place called mangoes i want to say mangoes uh i'm gonna get breakfast um yeah and then just start this day and enjoying this morning Yeah. 
takes you everything. I'll, I'll get it right later. But I ordered stuff, uh, Bobano peppers. It looks absolutely delicious. Check it out. It looks fried actually with the potatoes. Um, the singing crew is in the wrapping now actually. I'm gonna show you guys what it is. So delicious. How is it, Ryan? Amazing. Pretty good. The orange juice in Mexico, it's so different. Wait, it's so fresh. It's so fresh. What time is it? It's 8.30 in the morning now. 8.30. I'm so drunk. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh no, it's like Oaxaca cheese though. Oh, but too good cheese. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that. This is so good. Mmm, it's really the sauce though. It is sauce. It's spicy. What's this one? Spicy? Something is spicy in here. around town checking out all the little local shops it's a lot of shops this town is so cute a lot of souvenir shops um, we drove around you know I really think Eastland is one of those places you can't come for one day and leave you definitely got to come for like I would say three days and spend time in each part of the island because there's so many different parts and it's beautiful all of them are so beautiful Okay, so we finally made it to the beach. Beautiful day for the beach and I'm super excited. I freshened up a bit for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm excited to just like swim in the ocean. I've been in Texas for almost a month and I just got back to Mexico. So I'm pretty excited to be back at the beach. Sorry, I'm gonna take my shoes off. We need the beach to the shoes around. to watch our stuff but i want to go to the ocean and take you guys to the ocean and enjoy the water let's go Alright guys, so I'm in the water. Look how blue this water is. Look at the boats back there. I made a friend, Maya. She's from Peru. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> We're enjoying the beautiful blue waters, taking our photos, enjoying ourselves. Ryan's way back there being a grump, but it's okay. We're still having a good time. Woo! I love these love. Yes. What do you want? Mango, lemon, strawberry. 
Mango. So wow, many, you have so many. No, coconut. What's the red one? Strawberry? Strawberry. Oh, you yeah, have mango. I want mango. Mango. Come on, see how much mango and espanol. Mango. Oh, just mango. Mango, mango. <laughs> oh, mango. Go oh, mango. Oh, perfecto. Muchas gracias. Mm. And what else parts? <laughs> So beautiful. You're in my vlog. Say hi. Hi. Say hi, Ryan. How's that popsicle? Uh -huh. It's another smile. It's, it's another so smile. beautiful today. I'm gonna send you all these videos. Uh, oh, right there. So we've reached the end of the day, guys. And I've had a beautiful time with my new friend Maya. Bye. <laughs> And I'm gonna travel to Peru and hang out with her for a bit. But it's such a beautiful day. Hola, como estas? <laughs> so we stopped and we have to leave the beach because we gotta head back to Cebu um, this evening. We didn't want to leave too late because we still have to take the ferry to, to, to Cancun and then take the bus back to Tulum. So, um, we're having lunch um, before we get our things from Airbnb. And in fact, this is what I'm having for lunch. It's an empanada. It's like uh, chicken in the inside. It's so good. It came with cold slaw. And we're back at Mango's actually. I came here earlier for breakfast. Um, and back again. That's how good it was. So if you're ever in Isla Mayanes, I recommend coming to Mango's. Just took the scooter back. Say goodbye to our scooter. We got our things, uh, driver license back, and now we're gonna check the ferry time so we can catch the ferry back to Cancun. And I had an amazing day though. Absolutely beautiful day. Isla is literally a pretty amazing island. And I think if you're ever in Mexico, make sure Isla, is on your list because absolutely stunning place. Stunning. At the ferry station, getting the ticket, we gotta hurry because it's only leaving at 2 30, which is right now. And like, we gotta go. So these are the prices for the tickets, these are the time. Gate. Heading out. Gotta go. Boarding, general boarding. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Is it? I don't know about that. We made it. I don't know why it's going. It's in the, it's in the, it's in the. Dude, dude, dude. Bye guys, good morning. I shall be back, Isla. I shall be back.
Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a beautiful day.